Alright, Mario will restart, so yeah, good luck, have fun. So now we will start. Grand final of ESL RPG Night Cup. We got eight players who qualified to it through uh, two time attack rounds. First one, the top 50% qualified, and then in the second one, top 8 qualified. And here we go, first round. Now everyone is uh, live here as well. Oh, we see a mistake from Boss Boss. Fell out. There he is, so he's currently at last place. Revolution takes the lead, but this is all about avoiding getting last. Played in knockout. Bass Bass is behind now with uh, around 15 seconds, which uh, for RPG is not too much. In all other formats it's quite a lot, but uh, not for this. So it's not over here for Bass Bass, you can still make a comeback quite easily. And right now he wants to catch up to Kilburn, who is at 7th place. No, actually Manu is at 7th place. The checkpoints are pretty uh, spread out, so... Last boss can see Manu here. He's getting closer and closer. In the lead though we have Mario who won the first round and then got second in the second. Last boss with good speed here in the tunnel. And he will overtake Manu but they are very close. Let's see if I can find Manu here. There he is. Close battle between these two players. Manu is ahead. You can see the other players here in front. They are not uh, that far ahead. And it seems like Manu was forced to respawn here, so Bas Bas will get a bit of a lead. Manu currently at last place. See ya, it's sir. Ooh, but what happened with Bas Bas? And I think someone else now is last, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, Rehax has fallen down to last place. Rehax, who got first in the second time attack round. Very capable of driving fast times, but he is at last place, so he must have made a huge mistake. Uh, if I'm not completely mistaken here. It's a bit hard to know who's last. I guess Bass Bass is the one that's last. Or not. It's just very close between the players, that's it. Like, all players here are really close to each other. It's hard to say who's actually last. I think maybe. Uh, XD might be last. Yeah, XD is the one that's last right now. There he is. Or not. Kilburn is last. <laughs> They're also close to each other. Okay, let's follow Kilburn as he just passed. Oh, he makes a mistake. Forced to respawn and also uh, go backwards here to build up the speed. Otherwise, he can't make it. Oh, wait, never mind. He was supposed to go the other way. So, Kilburn, with that unfortunate mistake, will lose quite a lot. That checkpoint but was far away as well. So, um,. Really the worst mistake you can do is just before a checkpoint, because then you have to respawn to the previous one, and that one can be pretty far away. You see Kilburn on his back here, so pretty rough right now. And 
and only about three minutes left of this uh, round, so Kilburn. It's looking pretty grim, but then we see Manu is not too far ahead of him. So he's definitely not out of it, but that's an unfortunate mistake again. Trying to drive into this tunnel is Kilburn, and he won't make it again, but someone else is also respawning. I think it's XD, yes. XD and Kilburn makes it this time, but now XD is last. Gets a bit stuck. Uh, the problem is just that um, the timers are really uh, spare, spares, I guess. So they are far away from each other, so it's hard to know like exactly who's last. Can't really base it on the checkpoints, because they are so far away from each other. But XD is currently the one that's last. Kilburn only one second ahead or so. Two seconds. As you have about one and a half minute left to play in this round. Last player is knocked out, and that's currently XD. But Kilburn with a mistake. And they are very close to each other here. Oh, that's an unfortunate mistake. But at least Kilburn avoided um, getting on his back. But what's this? Kilburn is stuck. Kilburn is stuck and he can't get up. He needs to respawn. Yeah, he is forced to respawn and that's gonna cost him a lot. This checkpoint, I believe, was very far away. So Kilburn is dead last now. And he's not far away from the finish either, so this might be it. This might be the first player that's eliminated. ESU Kilburn. Kind of have to rely on a mistake from another player here. Currently, uh, around uh, six seconds behind Bass Bass, who is uh, at seventh place. Seven seconds might sound uh, like a lot, but in RPG, it's not that much. But I think players are starting to finish uh, this lap now, so... It's starting to look pretty dark for Kilburn. No one's finished yet, though. Alright, here's the first player, Revolution. 7 minutes 52 seconds. He says two big fails where he lost 30 seconds. Still took first though, so... And then we have Mario at second place. 8 minutes 4500. Rehax, who was at last place for a brief moment, takes third. As we see Kilburn getting stuck. All players, really, with a lot of mistakes. Marius89 takes fourth. 8 minutes, 32 seconds, 82 hundreds. Oh, what happened to Bass Bass? Bass Bass with a huge mistake, and Kilburn can still make it. Kilburn not too far behind, and he will actually overtake Bass Bass. Bass Bass is at last place now. This suddenly got very exciting. Kilburn out of nowhere gets a second chance here. We are very close to the finish. Bass Bass will take over the lead, takes a different line, takes a better line than uh, Kilburn. Uh, or what? I'm really confused. Uh, anyway, Manu and XD has also finished, and where is Kilburn? I don't. What? Kilburn has retired. Uh, I'm confused. <laughs> I'm not sure what happened uh, there, but uh, Kilburn uh, retires, or maybe he disconnected.
I'm not sure what happened there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so Kilburn is eliminated. And here we go, second round. Oh, I see, he didn't take the ring. Ah. Uh, I see. So you can take like different paths here, I guess. Like uh, you can decide to take the ring at the end or at the start. So maybe that's why I was really confused in the start of the first round. That would explain it. That also makes it really hard to cast because I don't know which ones took the ring and which ones didn't. So yeah. But it looks like XD is currently the player that's last. Let's switch to him. But I believe, I guess maybe he took the ring then, and that's why he's last. So he might be able to come back in the end. Okay, they are the same. Okay, so XC made a mistake then. And is currently last five seconds behind the Morris 89. It seems to me that this map uh, is a bit harder than. Uh, the map that was used in the previous RPG Night Cup. Here we see all the other players. Not too far ahead of XD yet. Five seconds is really nothing. So XD shouldn't feel too stressed about it. Should just focus on his race. avoid the mistakes. about three seconds behind Morris in 99 so he's uh, catching up and there he is Ooh, Morris 89 almost fell on his back but did a nice save nice save And uh, what? Is Revolution now second to last? No? I guess he is, yeah. Or actually, Manu is currently last now. He made a mistake somewhere. didn't make a jump so forced to respawn here that's gonna cost him made it this time but uh, yeah he's very far behind now 40 seconds 
So looks like Manu will be knocked out. As he has a very strong finish. But uh, yeah, this track does seem a bit harder than uh, the track that was used in the previous RPD Night Cup, so more mistakes, I guess, is to be expected. So maybe it's not over for Mano as we do see XD not too far behind here, so not too far ahead, rather. So Mano, he was uh, 20 seconds behind and now, or 40 seconds. Now he's pretty close. Another mistake from Manu. I think. Or maybe that was the way to go. That's a mistake though. And did he actually retire? I think he might have retired. That might have been by accident. I'm not sure. Or he just gave up. In that case, um, in any case, Manu is the next player eliminated. So we're down to top 6 now. Mario Rehax, Revolution, Bass Bass, Mario City 9 and XD. Just need to focus on uh, finishing this round. Mario said 9 currently last, but uh, just needs to focus on not accidentally retiring basically. And he will make it to the next round. Mario finishes, 7 minutes, 43 seconds, 1100. So he continues to drive uh, pretty consistent here. And then we have Reacts at 2nd place, 9 seconds behind, or 10 rather. Revolution takes 3rd. Then Bass Bass at 4th place. And XD should be pretty close as well to finishing. Here he is. Takes 5th place and then lastly Mario City 9. We just have to finish this. Manu was the player eliminated as he retired the round. Last player is always knocked out. So now the six players left are Mario, Rehaxed, Revolution, Bass Bass, XD, and Marius89. Here we go, next round. XD falls down to last place in the start. But they're all gathered up here, all players.
And no one has really made a mistake yet. Good section by XD, it's catching up a bit. Oh, I missed it, but Maurice 89 has actually made a mistake. And he makes another mistake! Forced to respawn, and that's gonna cost him quite a lot, quite many seconds. So, bad start for Maurice 89. Who I believe took, uh, took third last Night Cup. If I'm not mistaken. But yeah, he's two checkpoints behind now. So, uh, that cost him a lot. Still haven't reached uh, the sixth checkpoint. Here we go. Here he comes, and he is few, 14 seconds behind. So yeah, that's uh, that's quite a lot, but uh, still very early here in this round. He can definitely make a comeback. Three checkpoints behind at this part. Gets a bit stuck here, but got enough speed to uh, get up on top. Over 15 seconds behind XD though, so he's not really uh, catching up here. Gets a bit stuck again here. Halfway through the track now, and Morris 89 remains at last place. Huge mistakes in the start of the round. And he's about 15 seconds behind XD, who is. Uh, Currently at 5th place. Last player is knocked out. Forced to back up here. It's gonna cost him even more. Oh, wait, what? <laughs> this like, um, I don't know, a bit confusing here, but 
Did Bass make a mistake? Yeah, I guess he did because XD is now last all of a sudden. And XD is far behind, so he must have made a huge mistake just before a checkpoint probably. So yeah, XD currently last now. Man, he must have lost like 30 seconds. And he, he has to respawn again. Oh, that is very costly. So now XD is behind with, I don't know, like one minute maybe? I don't even know. And he makes another mistake. This is terrible for XD. He just can't seem to get past this part of the track. He is dead last right now. Four checkpoints behind Bass Bass. So this section of the track just... Uh, well, you don't want to make a mistake here, that's for sure. Finally made that uh, jump there. Which is uh, what he had trouble... Trouble with. So unless anything drastic happens here, XD will be the next player knocked out and we are down to top 5. He gets stuck here as well. Yeah, this is bad. And again he gets stuck. And in the meantime Mario with a new Deadly Mania record, world record even, 7 minutes 20 seconds, uh, 10 hundreds, so really good by Mario. Shows that he is uh, the big favorite for this. He won the previous cup as well, so I guess most people are expecting him to win and XD, <laughs> XD gets stuck at a very uh, interesting place. And Mario is still the only player who's finished, so pretty much in a league of his own here. No one's close. Rehax finishing second now, 7 minutes 59 seconds with the 800s. So 40 seconds behind Mario. That is a lot. Revolution takes third, 8 minutes 2 seconds. And then we should have uh, Mario's 89 and Bass Pass finishing soon as well. For the longest time, it looked like Mario's 89 would be the next player knocked out, but then XD. Uh, didn't make uh, a jump a couple of times and uh, lost a lot by that. And another mistake here for XD. Morris at 9, 8 minutes 49 seconds. And uh, XD gives up, retires. Nine minutes, twelve seconds by Bass Bass. So uh, XD, the next player knocked out. And uh, starting the next round. So now we are down to top five. Mario, Revolution, Rehax, Morris, Id9, and Bass Bass are the players left. And it seems like uh, Revolu Revolution had to uh, respawn. And he had to do it very late as well. So he's behind now. Or never mind, Maurice Ed 9 has made an even bigger mistake. And is currently last. But only with about one second. Uh, I want to follow the last player because that's really what's interesting. Uh, whoever gets knocked out. And right now the bell is between Mario's 89 and Revolution. But it's still very early and uh, 
yeah, as we saw in the previous round, I mean, Mario 89 was like 40 seconds behind. And still finished pretty comfortably in the end. Since XD made a lot of mistakes. So yeah, Morris 9 still, or uh, once again, is at last place, but uh, really no point in uh, worrying the too much. You can still see Revolution, so I mean, it's much better than in the previous round. about four seconds behind catching up a bit here now only two seconds behind so Oh, but then he gets stuck at the rails and falls on his back. So lost about 5 seconds with that. Very tricky here. Hard to stay on your wheels. In the top though, Mario is uh, leading as usual. Bass Bass second, Rehax uh, falls down to uh, fourth place. Revolution passes him, and Mario's 89 is last. And we cut quite a lot. He was close to getting eliminated in the previous round, and now again finds himself in a bad situation here. And he's about 20 seconds behind. It's not impossible to come back from. But uh, we're entering the second half of the track now, so it's getting more stressful, of course. So we might see more risk, uh, risky driving here. For Mori's in 9 and he won't make that, so he force respawn and yeah now we're coming to this part where uh, where XD had a lot of uh, trouble so maybe someone else will have that again in that case Mario's 89 can catch up a lot uh, it doesn't seem like anyone made a mistake there so Mario's 89 still at last place And that's bad, of course. Makes it this time, but lost like 10 or 15 seconds with that mistake.
and force to respawn again. So yeah, this looks like Marius89 will be the next player knocked out. And we are down to uh, four players in that case. Mario, Rehax, Revolution and Bass Bass. Mario should be pretty close to finishing now. I guess uh, we can uh, spectate him as he drives into the finish. Might have another good time in the making. Last round set a new world record. And here he goes. 7 minutes 44 seconds, 8900. So not as fast this time, but still uh, outstanding. No one is close. Revolution. Still a couple of uh, turns here before he finishes as well. Oh, actually, Rehax was second, never mind. So Rehax uh, with uh, another time under 8 minutes. And then Revolution will take third, 8 minutes 10 seconds. And then we have Bass Bass, who will take fort. And that will eliminate Maurice89. Who I guess uh, will still finish uh, the round. Eight minutes fifty seconds. And here we go, next round. Now uh, it might be a bit closer here, although this track just seems really hard, so I don't know. Mario takes the early lead as expected. Made of Bass Bass and Revolution and Rehax at last place right now. Turn by Rehax, but then he gets stuck in the fence. And someone had to respawn. That was uh, Revolution had to respawn. Got to be very careful here at the at the wall here, so you don't fall out. You don't have too much speed. Makes it this time, but is currently not last because Mario has respawned as well. So Mario, for once, is uh, not at first place. But if he's driving uh, as he can, then he will probably catch up pretty quickly here to the others. As long as he doesn't make another mistake. He must have uh, respawned just before the next checkpoint, because he's quite far behind there. 8 seconds behind the uh, revolution right now. So that would be a... Uh, Quite an upset if Mario is uh, eliminated here. But it's still very early, of course, so I would not uh, count him out yet. And as we can see here, Rehax makes a mistake and Mario will pass him. So Rehax right now facing elimination. See if he can keep up with Mario here. 
Green Hex is also set pretty fast times. It's not uh, that slower, so I'll probably keep up with Mario here for a while. Mario gets a bit of a lead here. High profile. Oh, Mario gets stuck and also rehacks. Both players get stuck, and it's really neck and neck here. Very close. In the meantime, Revolution is in lead ahead of Bass Bass. But this fight is what's interesting right now, since the last player is knocked out. Right now, that is Rehax. And he will actually pass Mario. So Mario back to last place again. But that's a good turn. It's uh, again uh, overtaking rehacks back and forth between these two. And we have driven uh, halfway through this track, so. Oh, and rehacks is forced to respawn. That might be uh, decisive. Rehax needs to drive very good if he wants to make a comeback here. Or if someone can make a mistake. Oh, we see Bass Bass uh, get stuck there, so Mario will actually pass him. And he's currently now at third place, or second place, I mean. So now Rex needs to get past uh, Bass Bass, as we have two minutes left of this track. It's not too far uh, behind here, Rex. Four seconds, definitely doable. Can I have a strong finish? Seems like he's catching up quickly. Two seconds behind now. And there he is. Bass Bass gets stuck. And also Rehacks. Oh my god. Rehacks with the same mistake. And Rehacks. Will he have enough speed? Or He will have enough speed. But that was a missed, missed opportunity from Rehacks. Had he taken that turn uh, normally, he would have passed Bass Bass. Rex still at last place. And now Rex needs to risk uh, these last turns here. We cannot afford falling out, falling uh, down here, or anything like that. Then it's over. He needs to try drive perfectly. There is Bass Bass. So we've got a couple of seconds here uh, in the lead. Uh, 
Revolution will finish first. Nice time as well. 7 minutes 36 seconds and Rehax gets stuck. That might be it. Mario takes second, 7 minutes 43 seconds. So even though Mario had that uh, early mistake, it still sets a pretty good time. And uh, where's Bass Bass? Is he close to the finish? Yes, he is. One turn left for Bass Bass. And we're gonna have Rehax getting knocked out at fourth place. Good effort though. So we're down to top 3 now. Revolution, Mario and Bass Bass. So who's gonna take 2nd, 1st, 2nd and 3rd? That will be decided now. Bass Bass uh, has the worst time here. He's not got a time under uh, 8 minutes, but still made it to top 3. So, definitely uh, interesting to see if we can take another player here. Revolution and the Mario has set very fast times, uh, both of them, so. It's gonna be tough for Bass Bass uh, to match that. And he is currently at last place as well. And he will fall down. Bad start for Bass Bass on his own track. That will cost him uh, five seconds or more, and he gets stuck again. This is a disaster for Bass Bass. Absolute disaster. Two huge mistakes in a row, and now it's pretty much over already. I don't. I just don't see Revolution and Mario uh, making similar mistakes here. They've been very fast and consistent. So a bit anti-climatic here. And another mistake just before the checkpoint. Bass Bass will try to drive on his back but he's not gonna make it. He's forced to respawn and of course that's uh, the worst place. To make a mistake. I think that's where Mario made a mistake in the previous round actually. So that's gonna cost him like 20 seconds or something. Currently three checkpoints behind uh, Mario and uh, Revolution here. Oh, that's bad as well. He's forced to respawn uh, for the fourth time, I believe. And now five checkpoints behind, so yeah, this is... Uh... This is not gonna happen. And, okay, made it. He writes GG in the chat as well, so... He knows it. But he will continue driving here, try to finish. Top 3 though, not too bad. And Reax writes in the chat, why didn't you do this round before? <laughs> Touche. And another mistake. It's actually, uh, we can, might as well just uh, follow Revolution and Mario here as they uh, finish uh, the race, finish the round. And they are gonna battle it out in the last round for first place. And they are definitely the two fastest uh, drivers here as well, so. Definitely may makes sense that they are the two last players.
Oh, Mario with a mistake, forced to respawn. He was first. But uh, yeah, he's uh, four checkpoints ahead of uh, Bass Bass here, so... He can definitely afford it. I definitely think uh, Revolution got a chance though in the last round. I mean, Mario is definitely the favorite. Uh, he got the fastest time. He's like 15 seconds faster than Revolution, but... If Revolution can set a uh, 7 minutes uh, 30 second uh, time, then I think he got a chance. Definitely. And Mario will overtake him. Good stuff. He seems to be very strong in the second half of the round, and uh, Revolution out of nowhere comes back. Two minutes remaining of this round. And it looks like Revolution had to respawn. We see some different um, strats in this part here. Rehax uh, drove into the wall and then just backed it up to line it up. And then Revolution makes two drifts instead. I wonder which one's the fastest. I guess I should spectate Mario for that. And uh, Mario made a mistake. So I guess Revolution will win this round. That might give him some uh, confidence for the final round. Knowing that he can uh, defeat Mario. And a good time as well. 7 minutes 37 seconds. 7 minutes 39 seconds by Mario, so a good race by those two players, really. That was a good race. Alright, so Bass Bass will finish at third place, and now one final round remains Revolution versus Mario for first place. And Bass Bass. Uh, Falls out of the track here, I guess he wants to finish. No, he retires. Alright, so here we go, last round of ESL RPG Night Cup number 5. Mario won the previous one, will he be able to defend this title? Here we go. He made an early mistake, uh, was it two rounds ago? So he may be a bit... Uh, not that confident in the start here, but we see Revolution getting stuck again! And uh, so he gets a bad start instead. We'll be behind with a couple of seconds. And of course this, is, uh, this can be pretty stressful, especially in the final round. But uh, really no need to be stressed, uh, stressed out in the beginning here, because after all it is uh, 
almost eight minutes long, so you gotta keep your head cool and your focus uh, high. And Revolution can still make a comeback here. But we know that Mario is capable of driving very fast times. Set a world record of 7 minutes 20 seconds. And uh, as you can see, Revolution's fastest time is uh, 15 seconds slower, 16 seconds slower even. So Mario definitely the fastest driver here. But Revolution definitely got a chance. Currently about 5 seconds behind Mario. Oh, that's an unfortunate mistake. Did not make the jump and has to respawn. And uh, approximately 5 seconds lost here as well. Or even more, that was uh, quite far away. Yeah, it was just before the checkpoint as well, which is definitely the worst place to make a mistake like that. So now Mario with a uh, great opportunity here. ahead with uh... wow so much time and um, yeah 22 seconds 22 23 seconds lead for Mario here so uh, starting to look a bit grim for evolution And get stuck here as well. In the meantime, here's Mario. Let's uh, compare him to the local one record, which is his own record, to see how fast he's actually driving here. We'll see that in the next checkpoint. He's only 67 hundreds behind, so Mario is driving at his best right now. 8 hundreds behind. He's driving uh, super fast. That is not a good sign uh, for Revolution, who seems to have gotten stuck again. And oh, almost fell on his back just before the checkpoint. That would have been terrible. 26 seconds behind the local record. So he's still driving a time under 8 minutes, which isn't too bad, but Mario is just driving so much better and without any mistakes so far. We did see him make uh, a couple of mistakes in the previous round in the end though, but I don't know, it's, uh, Revolution is uh, close to 30 seconds behind now I think, so it's gonna be tough. And that's not gonna help. Okay, still one checkpoint behind here. Now this part here, uh, we've seen uh, XD had a lot of trouble with this jump here. But Mario will make it first try. And it goes through this section uh, very smoothly as well. Yeah, I think Revolution might have made another mistake because he's now four checkpoints or three checkpoints behind. So, yeah, this looks more and more that Mario will defend his title and take home the ESL RPG Night Cup five. He's uh, got about two minutes left here, and he's uh, only four seconds behind his local record, so... He is showing how it's done right now. How to drive uh, RPD. Ok, 
good turn here as well. Face the right direction. Yeah, he saved one second with that on his local record, so very nice. Oh, had to uh, back it up a bit here, so maybe he won't get a new local record, but this will still be a very good time. 7 minutes, uh, maybe under 7 minutes 30 seconds. He's still only 4 seconds behind, so it's definitely possible. Gets a bit stuck here as well. And now only a few checkpoints left, I believe, for Mario. Revolution still very far behind. Got a very rough uh, beginning in this round and just couldn't keep it up after that. Especially not that Mario is driving this good. 7 seconds behind, so this uh, might be a time under 7 minutes and 30 seconds, which would be the second fastest time of this uh, tournament. And here we go, 7 minutes 28 seconds, 20 hundreds, GG. IGN Mario takes home the ESL RBD Night Cup. Revolution takes 2nd, uh, and 3rd uh, place uh, goes to Bass Bass. So that's our top 3.